Hello, I'm Juan Fernandez and this is The Rundown. Police in Riverside say an employee at a school for children with special needs was providing fentanyl to students. They say at least a dozen students were given the drug by the school's bus driver at Bright Futures Academy and that a search of her home on campus found over 100 suspected fentanyl pills, two guns and ammunition. New LA Unified Superintendent Arbelto Carvalho gave students a first-hand lesson in civics when he visited Woodrow Wilson High School in El Sereno today to register to vote. Carvalho recently moved from Florida and registered with his new address along with students who are now eligible to vote. Well, a big warning sign for the economy today. Experts say Wall Street is close to falling into a bear market. That means a steep and a sustained drop of 20% or more from recent highs that briefly happened to the S&P 500 today. This is all being fueled by concerns over rising inflation. All right, now let's take a look at the forecast with meteorologist Alex Piston. Hi everybody, happy Friday. I'm meteorologist Alex Biston. Well, we are looking at gloomy conditions across Southern California today. The marine layer is expanding from the coast all the way to the valleys. Because of that, we will have cooler temperatures this afternoon and drizzle is possible as we head into tomorrow morning. So we could see a little bit of moisture being squeezed out of these marine layer clouds. Now, if you like the gloomy conditions, soak it in now because we have a warming trend starting Sunday. It's going to continue as we head into next week. Highs this afternoon, 60s from the coast all the way through Orange County, lower 70s in the valleys in the Inland Empire. So temperatures, of course, cooler than what we felt yesterday, upper 70s across the high desert with 60s up in the mountains. Here's our satellite and radar tracker, and you will notice those clouds hanging out with us pretty much through the day today. And it's the same story as we head into tomorrow morning, but there will be changes as we will see a quicker clearing, a little bit more sunshine as we head into Saturday afternoon. And of course, a warming trend as we head into next week as temperatures rise back into the upper 80s across our valley communities, upper 70s downtown with lower 70s along the coastline. Look for lower 70s this afternoon in the Inland Empire, lower 80s in the high desert with upper 60s in the mountains. Remember, we're always streaming on CBS News Los Angeles, and you can watch us anytime on our free CBS LA app and on CBSLA.com. I'm Juan Fernandez.